said when he reached the Americas, when the Moors pointed him there, he thought he had gone to Africa. Listen to me, family. He had thought he went to Africa. Why did he think that? Because the people that he came upon when he first hit the Americas had thick hair, black thick hair. Some had froze, some had curly hair. A lot of the women had their hair trussed down in braids and and um, ropes around their braids, beautiful indigenous and feathers. But some of the men had froze. Listen to me. This is what he denoted. He had gotten pictures and sketches that are in Italy right now, in Sicily, that we can go in Europe. In Europe, a lot of this information was absolutely kept intact. Only in the Americas do they lie to you and say there was different people here. He thought he saw Africans. Not Indians, no. He said Africans. Indians had obviously straighter hair. If you know the difference between some of the genomes of Eastern Indians, Indians have very straight hair, very refined hair that's straight, not curly and not frizzy. When you start seeing frizzy and coily hair, you start going in the Indonesian islands, the Polynesian islands, you'll see women likened to myself. But in the Americas, when Columbus came here in his journals, he said he thought they were Negroes. Because they all had coily hair and dark black, this is a terminology he used, negro skin. Okay? Why we have to have this discussion is because I'm really...